They're doing uh, training uh, on the lashing and unlashing of uh, container boxes on the ship. Lashing. That's a very strenuous uh, job. Uh, it takes a lot of endurance and strength. The lashing is the most of that labor intensive, and it, it is physically demanding on a person. It's also dangerous. Now, with the training program that we have today, it gave these uh, girls here a chance to come down and experience it, and they uh, passed the course. When the ship rolls in, uh, we've got to uh, unsecure it to get ready for the uh, crane to lift off, to put it in the yard, to be shipped out all over Canada or the States or whatever. To me, it seems like more of a mental workout than it is about your body, even though obviously it's necessary that you have enough strength, but sometimes you can just get a little overwhelmed by the length of the bar and, you know, maybe some people standing around looking at you do it. It does get intimidating because it is typically a male-dominated workplace, but, I mean, just deal with the men like you normally do on a normal day and everybody's actually pretty nice and pretty helpful around here. Because I used to be a computer analyst many years ago and then after I had a child I decided that I wanted to work outdoors. Being outdoors, enjoying the fresh air and sunshine, even if you do have some hard work, I, I, I mean there's nothing better for me. Nothing. Yeah, I've uh, come from a family of longshoremen's and uh, it's definitely not for, mo you know, your average girl, I should say, but uh, tough skin does the work and, you know, it's definitely worth it if you've got the, the backbone to, <laughs> to handle it. How dangerous is this? Very. You could get squished just as easy as stepping in the wrong place and if you uh, don't watch where you're going, you probably will die. <laughs> Uh, definitely empowering. I definitely don't want any other job. <laughs> I guess it's a good step forward for women in the trades, but there's also a lot of work to be done with, you know, women in trades and equity of pay and how we're treated also. And that's not something that we talk about a lot. We interviewed uh, and, and took applications for about 140 people and out of the 140, uh, seven women, uh, out of the seven women, uh, we put them through the Lasher test and uh, unfortunately only three, three passed. We're trying to uh, diversify the workforce, get some women in it. Uh, it is challenging. It's, it's uh, mostly machinery now. Uh, the, the heavy work is, is gone with the exception of the lashing. It's, uh, the lashing's the most of that labor intensive, and it, it is physically demanding on a person. Right now we have three, four generation longshore, longshoremen working on the waterfront here. Something that once you get in your blood, it doesn't leave. tips from your grandfather coming in? Uh, swear a lot and uh, don't take anything personal I guess. <laughs>
What would you say to other women who were thinking about getting into something like this? Do some push-ups and get down here. <laughs> and you know, if you can lift that bar, then uh, all the power to you, right? I'd love to see more women on the, on the board, for sure.